guys, it's Daisy. Uh, welcome back to my channel. And if you've already been here, welcome back. So uh, good news, guys. I just got a call from Crew Scheduling. And if you don't know what Crew Scheduling is, Crew Scheduling is basically the people who make the flight attendant schedules. So you can go really anywhere. You they, they tell you where to go and you just go. So they called me and they just told me that I have a trip to Gainesville, Florida. I am so excited. I've never been to Gainesville, Florida, one and two. I've been craving to go to the beach for far too long now, especially with COVID, no. <clears throat> especially with the, th um, the things that are going on right now. So I am super excited and I have a reason to go other than just craving it. So I am currently on day three of day no, no. Actually, I'm on day four. Yeah, I'm on day four, actually, of my six-day work week of being on call. And it's been pretty easy for me so far, which is extremely surprising because the last time I did six days, I was running around the country like a mad person. I actually counted how many trips I did, and I ended up doing 24 trips in total. And also, excuse the shaky camera, I'm in my car, so, you know, I'm holding it with my hand, holding the camera with my hand. So right now, I'm actually going to grab something quick to eat. Right now, I am craving Bojangles, so that's what I'm about to get. And after that, I literally will have to rush to the airport. I have one hour to get there, but the way I drive, I don't, I'm not the fastest driver. So because of that, I do, I do have to hurry up, but I need to get my tummy full first. Um, I'm trying to think what else there might need to be said, but I think that's actually it right now. So I'll go ahead and take y'all on a little adventure with me. Guys, when I say I'm excited, I'm so excited to be going to Florida. I love, love Florida. I'm finally in Gainesville. So I talked to my coworkers I'm working with and to find out there isn't a beach here. I seriously just thought that like Gainesville, since it's like um, one of the bigger cities, a more well-known cities in Florida, that it was gonna like have a beach. But no, um, they told me they're like, no. So we're actually inland and that means we don't have a beach. So I Googled the closest one and it's about um, like almost 40 minutes away. That's a lot of, <laughs> a lot of time wasted if I do that. And it's not like, um, like a big beach either. So I'm just not going to go. I'm just going to go to the swimming pool, um, go get something to eat and probably walk around. Um, I don't know if I'm going to go to the university. I think, is it, you know, there's a university here. I don't even remember the name of it. Um, I think I saw like University of Gainesville or something like that, but there's a university around here. Maybe I'll walk over there. Obviously the college is not even open right now because it's, um, it's August and it's the beginning of August. So there's not really going to be anyone there on the campus. So we'll see if that's what I decide to do. Not really sure yet, but let me show you my hotel room. It looks really nice and I love it, it's so cozy. Look how big this closet is. Like I'm, 
I'm just going inside of it. <laughs> and it leads to the bathroom, I think. Oh, yeah. Yep, sure does. And I'm going, and I'm going, and I'm going, and voila. Ooh, the bathroom's pretty spacious, too. And then the sink as well. Let's see, there's me again, y'all. <laughs> but I'm gonna go ahead, hurry up so that I can go ahead and get some food with my crew. We're starving, it's four o'clock. Um, I woke up at about 10 o'clock and y'all saw I had Bojangles, but that was hours ago. Now it's time to get some food and all that stuff. And I'll just um, give a little bit of an update later. Yeah, she said he's annoying. I was in Gainesville, Florida, and I couldn't go to the beach. So the closest beach was about 35, 40 minutes away, like I um, said previously. And obviously I was not going. And I was not gonna pay all that money for Uber. But on the bright side, I'm in Gulfport, Mississippi, and Lo and behold, there's a beach. I didn't even know there were beaches in Mississippi, but oh my God. Like, I think that's the craziest thing ever. The irony, like you're in Florida. Like, I'm in Florida and thinking, okay, there's gonna be a beach and there's no beach, but I'm in the middle of nowhere, Mississippi, and there's a beach. So, and of course I'm gonna enjoy myself a little bit. I'm gonna stay for uh, maybe an hour, maybe longer, who knows? Like, I'm just, guys, tell you, this, life is great right now i'm i'm really grateful because i love travel and just when you're not rich and the way i love to travel it's not very economical obviously <laughs> like i i love the travel amount i'm traveling right now like if i could be somewhere different every day which i obviously am doing now this is what like what i love to do but I'm gonna go and enjoy myself, so I'll catch y'all in a second. And I'm gonna show y'all around what the beach looks like. My dreams are coming true because I like I said I've been craving going to the beach for a while now and obviously here I am the beach is beautiful it's a warm water beach um, lots of sea life nice people beautiful weather um, it's very humid right now but considering being at the beach the weather it's great it's just fine. 
but I have one more day left I'm on day number five right now and with that being said so tomorrow I I you know, honestly I have no idea if my job is going to make me do a quick turn which means just going to a city and back or they're just going to like release me so really all just depends but that's going to be my sixth day and I, I don't know how I'm doing it, but I guess because I actually like to have the time off at the end of the month or whenever because, I mean, it's great having, like, the weekends off, but, I, but just being a flight attendant when you are working, having just two days off really isn't enough. It's not a nine to five where you work eight hours and you go home. It's not like that at all. So you definitely need your rest and... So having like those days bunched up helps a lot. But I'm going to be obviously leaving soon because look how dark it's starting to get. But other than that, so I'll definitely, um, I think I'm gonna go back in the water again. I haven't really made too many decisions. I'm trying to see if y'all can see me. Guess what? I am back from Gulfport, Mississippi. And so I had originally had another turn I had to do. So that was two other trips I would have had to do before possibly clocking out. But luckily all I had to do was do this one trip and then now I'm back home. And that is such a rarity. So I am soaking up every moment because right now it's 11 o'clock in the morning and my day generally would not end until 12 a.m. the next day. So just things like that when you're a flight attendant or you're just working in the airport, like having that extra time to yourself means the world. So I'm going to just enjoy my free time. Um, if you haven't already, like, subscribe, and share. And I'll be posting a little bit more soon. Bye, guys.